And back to Europe. We now go to our regional reporters to have a look at what the youth think about their future inside the European Union. First, we go to Madrid with Guillermo Burgos. Guillermo. Guillermo, can you hear me? Guillermo. Yes, check this out. I have received no audio. No audio, guys. Number three. We'll go for a commercial break first. You can't make me look Please like check. a piece of caca. Please check the number the three. Street. The microphone number three. Don't do this to me anymore. Sorry about I'm that, I'm going to walk out of this. This is one time too many. We are taking care of it. <sighs> Check his microphone, please. The number three. First, back to Madrid. I think that European citizens do not have enough control over the economical decisions that EU institutions take because we actually don't have any power. A minimum wage across the whole union. Because people don't know what the politicians are actually doing and what the EU is doing. So I think they have to speak to us and have a better communication to, to the youth and to the people. I think Europe should have uh, one and the same voice on the international stage. If we speak all together, uh, we are going to be much stronger. And we, are well, we don't seem to be having a good no. I don't